Yeah, welcome to my channel. Yeah, we are still on our course unit called Elements of Taxation. And in this video, we are going to be looking at the classification or categorization of taxes. Taxes are of several forms based on their characteristics and modalities of charging them. And they are mainly categorized into three forms. They are categorized according to the tax rates and base structure. They are also categorized according to the expression of the tax rate. And lastly, they are categorized according to the burden and impact of payment. So we are going to look at this categorization one category, yeah, one by one. Yeah. The first category is taxes are categorized according to tax rates and base structure. Yeah, a tax base is the item or economic activity on which the tax is levied or on which the tax is charged. Yeah, and the most commonly used tax bases are three. We have income, consumption, and then wealth. Yeah, and then taxes under this category are still categories into three. We have the regressive tax, we have the progressive tax, and then we have the proportional tax. Yeah, we are going to look at each of them in details, the progressive, regressive, and then proportional tax. Let's first look at progressive tax. Yeah, progressive. As you see, progress, it keeps on progressing, increasing. This tax is structured such that the effective tax rate increases as the tax base increases. The more you earn, is the more tax that you pay. Yeah, and this progressive tax is based on the principle of vertical equity. Vertical equity, the tax rate increases as the tax base increases. And an example of a progressive tax is pay in Uganda, which is pay as you earn. It brings, it brings out the progressive tax. Like the more someone earns, is the more tax that they pay. So the tax rate increases as the tax base increases. Yeah, and that's what we call progressive tax. It's based on the principle of vertical equity. Yeah, vertical equity, we, we, we said as the tax rate increases, the tax base increases. So that's what we call a progressive tax. Another tax is regressive tax. This tax is structured in such a way that the effective tax rate decreases as the tax base increases. Like the more you earn, the less tax that you pay. That's what we call regressive tax. Yeah. And an example of regressive tax, we have gas tax and cigarette tax. Yeah. If maybe a person is earning, is earning $10 and must pay $1 of tax on a package of cigarettes, this represents 10% of that person's income. But if the person is earning $20 of income and the person pays $1, $1 as tax, it only represents 5% of that person's income. So, the more income that you have, the less tax that you pay. Yeah, and that's what we call regressive income. Sales tax also represents also represents regressive tax. Yeah, they are generally considered to be regressive as well because of expenses for food, clothing, shelter tend to make up a higher percentage of tax on lower consumers yeah and lastly we have proportional tax proportional tax this is a tax whose tax rate remains fixed regardless of the amount of the tax base yeah you're supposed to pay tax of 200 whether your tax base increases whether it reduces you're supposed to pay that same amount of tax yeah OTT was a proportional tax because it was, it was constant. Whether you have 10 million, you were supposed to pay OTT of 200. Whether you have 1,000, you were supposed to pay OTT of 200. Yeah, so the tax rate remains constant regardless of the amount of the tax base. So this is an illustration showing the categorization of taxes 
according to the tax rate and the base structure. Yeah. On the x-axis, we have the income, and on the y-axis, we have the tax paid. Yeah, we are seeing the progressive tax. It's increasing as the, the tax paid is increasing as the income increases. And then we are seeing the proportional tax. It's constant, no matter the level of income. Then the regressive tax, it's reducing as the, the tax paid is reducing as the income increases. Yes, so that's the illustration of the categorization of tax basing on the tax rate and base structure. Yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share with your friends and watch my next video. We shall be talking about another category of taxes, which is expression of the tax rate.